High Cap and Gown Scholars. It's Mr. Bradford, math teacher at Jemison High School and Cap and Gown teacher coach. Our topic today is the ACT math section overview. The ACT math section has 60 questions, multiple choice, and you have 60 minutes to complete them. Now that's about one minute per question. The focus is on uh, topics in Algebra 1, Algebra 2, uh, Geometry, and a few in Trigonometry. Uh, the challenging part about uh, the ACT math is the wording in the questions, not the math itself. The ACT math section is structured from easiest to hardest, roughly. Uh, you will see most of the easiest problems in the beginning, and you'll see the harder concept problems in the end. Uh, it's roughly so you might see a harder question in the beginning of the test and you might see an easy question at the end of the test. Uh, so keep that in mind as you pace yourself. Uh, you do have 60 minutes to solve 60 questions, so uh, that's about a minute a question. Do not rush through the early problems on the test. Uh, they are easiest and take your time to do them correctly. All the questions on the ACT are worth the exact same amount. So make sure you get the easier questions correct. One of the ACT math strategies is do not read the instructions at the beginning of the test. Know all of the instructions ahead of time. You can do that by doing practice tests. Uh, you don't want to waste time rereading instructions that you already know. One of the basic strategies that we use is to use a watch. This is very important on the math section. Uh, again, you can wear a watch uh, to help you keep your pacing, uh, to make sure that you're not spending too much time on one question or on one section. Another strategy is you will answer the easiest questions first. Essentially, you're going to take the math section two times. All right, the first time you're going to do all of the easiest questions. All right, they're all worth the same point, so you want to get those easy ones out of the way. Then you're going to start back over and do all the questions that are remaining. All right. Make sure that you answer every single question. There is no penalty for wrong answers on the ACT. Uh, if you have to guess, pick a letter of the day and use that letter every time you guess. If your letter of the day is A, choose A for every single answer that you have to guess on. Don't skip back and forth from A to B to C to A. Just choose all the same letter. Last strategy, don't panic. The math test can be overwhelming but take your time take a breath and relax all right and you will do just fine focus on the easier problems then come back to the harder problems and you will be great all right that's all for today thanks for tuning in where are we going college